Well, hello there. My name is Island Jacaluce, and I'm going to demonstrate speed. All right, Ryan, what are we going to be doing today? Well, I guess I'm gonna have to do this myself then. Wait, where did the camera go? Hey, get over here. Oh, there you are, Ryan. Back from a long walk across the school, right? Dead. All right, Ryan, let's get this demonstration started. Now choose your vehicle. All right, I shall choose Line McQueen, Jr. Where did Ryan go? He went to take a dump. <laughs> All right, first things first, we'll be demonstrating speed. To demonstrate speed, we'll be rolling Light McQueen here down a, the ramp. We will calculate the speed with distance divided by time. Let's get started. So we're going to demonstrate speed, my good sir. I'll go first. All right, first demonstration, we'll be using a stopwatch right here that will be entrusted to my good sir, Jonathan. On your mark. Yes, sir. ka -chow. Well, that was a fail. I think we should use a different vehicle than Light McQueen. On your mark. Get set. Go! One point two. So our first demonstration is complete. So we will go onward to our second demonstration. Let's go. Alright. For our next demonstration, we will demonstrate friction. To demonstrate friction, we will use a car and roll it down the hallway. And we will tell you how friction works, we're gonna say. Onward. Ryan, get over here. Ryan. Get this clown. Welcome back, Ryan. I'm ready to get this demonstration started. Oh, okay, we already started. To explain now. So, Ryan, can you please explain how friction works? to the audience members at home. I don't know. This again, I guess I'll have to explain friction myself. Okay. Why does this car stop? It's because of friction. Friction is constantly hitting the car and stopping it. The car wants to go, but it can't go because of friction. Friction is a force that stops things. All right. We're not done with friction. Now on to unbalanced forces. Okay, we'll come back to the show for our third demonstration. I'll push the slinky down. Go! So the force of the slinky going down the stairs is more than the force of the slinky staying still. Since we push it down, therefore, we go down the stairs. Step one, we had to roll this car across the floor with no extra weight on it. This is my job. I'm the host of the show. Now sit down! Alright. Start your engines, racers. Now go! Alright, now to add pennies into the car. the show. Now that our vehicle has been custom made with some new Abraham Lincoln pennies, we will now show you that mass, adding more mass to a vehicle will slow it down. Let the demonstration begin. As you see, there it goes anyway. Well there you have it, force of motion. In this video we have covered speed, friction, unbalanced forces, and masses.